Hello friends, today I am with a new video in which we are going to see that how to use a whiteboard. Today we are going to see that new way to interact with our students live. Yes, live. So let us start. Whiteboard.fi. You can see over here the website whiteboard.fi. Yes, it is easy and it is freely available. You have to just click on to, you have to not to register over there. Not even you have to give a login, mail or anything. Just you have to go to that website, okay? And in that, you can just start your work, okay? So here, here what we can do? What are the advantages? So first is the advantages that you can do a quick assessment of your students. And the real-time response, you can get it from your students. This is a whiteboard, right? In which the code, whatever the code we are giving, that will be expired after two hours. So please keep it in mind that only for the two hours it is active. After that, it will be new code for you, right? So there are two options over here. That is one is new class and another one is join class. New class is for the teacher and join class is for the student. Yes, in new class, you can give the name. Okay, so just I'm clicking on add and I will give the name that is... Uh, like here, I am giving my name. Okay. I have just given my name and I will click on create. As I will click on create, you will see that the students can join. So, what we will do for joining? So, let us see first of all as it will create. Here, there are many options which you can see and you can do the settings according to it. You want to do the changes in that? Yes, you can do the changes over there. So, we have to wait a while. As you will create a class, you will get over there a room code, which you have to give it to your students. Yes. So, let us see now. It is going to be started. Yes, you can see over here a link which is available, right? So, in my class, what you will see, you will see an interface in between of two people, uh, two things that is my whiteboard and my class. My class in that you will see the students and in my whiteboard is the teacher, right, in which they are working, okay? So, let us see. First of all, in my class, you will see a link which you can share it with the students which is available on any device. They can use it on any device. It is not necessary that they have to use a laptop, they have to use a PC. They can do it in the mobile phone also. Yes. So, you, are, you can share this link by going to WhatsApp and just pasting that link and share it. Right. So, as I have shared it, you can see over there. It will take time. So, after that, you will have over here my whiteboard. Okay. So, now, here you can see the room code. If the students has left over there, so they can join by the room code. They can join by the room code. Okay. So, they will join it. Here, there are different settings which are being given. Okay. If you want that the names of the students may not be displayed, so you can go for hide names. Yes. Okay. And then we can see over here that you can clear all the whiteboards. If there are many students and for them you cannot do the work uh, separately. So you can go with the whiteboard. Okay. So now let us start. So we will see first of all that how to use this thing okay so here there is a lock room also you can see here we can lock it even we can close it as i have told you that you can close the room you can close the room over there right so what you will do if you will close it then it will be done for everyone okay so it will be locked if you want to lock it no one can go outside or maybe anyone else cannot enter so, you can lock the room. Okay. So, let us start. So, first, yes, you can see here that my class in that the person will join over here. You can see over here it will be joined. 
yes you can see here he is my son but yes he is joined over here okay so let us start here we have different things here free drawing mode if you want to do any drawing here uh, if you have the stylus yes you can use the stylus and you can prepare the stylus by your own also here we are having the eraser if you want to erase the drawing here we are having the text yes you can write with the text you can draw with the lines and arrows you can draw it okay triangle and many of the shapes are been given over there even you can insert the image so let us start first of all here the fill color you can see the font color you can see the font color you can take it by default it is black you can change it also if you want to make it more interactive more nice okay so let us start so first i am going to give one question over here right so like here 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 7 as i am writing over here right so my students can watch it that thing okay so i will go to my class and i will see the answer of them so i will click on that here it's not the answer still the students can see your white board over there when they will toggle right so when they will toggle so they will get it the answer they can write it in the form of text also or they can write it with the pen as i have told you the stylus you can prepare it by your own i'll click over here you can see as i've clicked i got the answer okay now we are having the actions over there so what are that actions like you want to save it that whiteboard you want to erase it or you want to push to teacher so if the teacher they want to see that the teacher what they have written so they can click on it okay so this is about it next if a student is uh, misbehaving or not uh, behaving properly or not giving properly that time you can kick the students from there so you can remove them i am just clicking on save uh, sorry erase as i have clicked on erase now i am going for the next question over there i can also clear over here my clear whiteboard i will click on clear whiteboard now i will draw a shape and i can ask to the students that what is the shape about so i will write the text as i will write the text okay i have written and press enter and then you can see over here that i will go to my class and my student will write over here if it is not proper then you can clear it so i will just erase it that answer okay and i can click on close again yes let let him try okay it takes time because it is done by the student right so yes i'll just click here still it is not there the answer is not there okay let him take a time then the next is what over here i will just click on clear and then i can go with an image yes i will insert an image like here i am inserting an image of yes now i can ask the question to the students that what is this character which character it is okay so yes i will ask them which cartoon character is this okay ticked from here and press enter okay now i will go to my class i 
will go to my class i will just see over there that there is anything written no still not written over there so i cannot see the response okay now let us see no answer still yes the answer is over here so now i can erase it okay so i'll just click on erase so this way you can make it many more things over your interactive way you can also take any of the english questions like uh, i will write it over here i'm writing okay what is the plural of night so you can see again it will be written over there they can use the text and even the pen to write it okay it is not necessary that they have to write in the text form only as i have written they can write it with the pen also okay then you can see the answer nice okay now you can click on erase or you can save it if there are many students then we have the option over here erase all whiteboards so you can click on erase if there are many students with you while interacting even when you have completed here we are having many of the options as you can see over here that a, a font size font you can change the font over here whatever the font you wanted you want to change the size of it yes you can change the size of it even here we are having the option of bold italic underline okay so this is about it hope you all have liked it please like and subscribe my channel and I wanted that many of the people may share with different people who are needed. Thank you.